Jim Carter here in Zionsville, and we're about to take a ride. Actually, we've already taken the ride, but for those who have just joined us, what is this? This is an M816 5-ton medium wrecker. It doesn't sound like something you can take out on, on a rural road in Zionsville. Oh, yes. But we're going to do it. Yes. Okay, here we are taking a ride just a few minutes ago, and we'll talk about it as we go. Okay, we're in the car truck. Very cool. How fast can you get this puppy up to? If my foot were flat on the floor <laughs> and a wind behind me and maybe downhill about 52 miles an hour. Okay, and I'm afraid to ask this, how many miles per gallon, sir, do you get? It's about four, maybe 4.4 .4 on a good day, okay. miles per gallon. Tough to take cross country. You, uh, yes. Yeah, exactly. Uh, now I'm watching you shifting. Okay, tell us about the gear situation. There's five gears. Uh, first gear is not synchronized, so you have to be at a dead stop before you shift into it. Yeah. Uh, and then the other four will get you going, but this uh, vehicle really doesn't accelerate. It gathers <laughs> momentum. Okay. <laughs> That's a great line. So, just to be specific, what did this do in the war? Well, this would have been used to retrieve any vehicle up to about its same weight, uh, maybe a little bit more. Uh, with the uh, rotating crane on the back, they could use it to load and unload uh, from other trucks uh, or whatever. And then it has two winches, one in the front, one in the back. The front winch usually used for self-recovery, in other words, if you got this stuck. Uh, the rear uh, winch uh, with the uh, sprags here, uh, mounted in the back, pushing down into the ground, uh, you have about 48,000 pounds of pull on that winch. Oh my goodness, so this could pull another tank? Uh, if, that, iffy on a tank. If, uh, iffy on a tank. But, an, but another truck, about another this, truck. or a Jeep or whatever, okay. uh, should be able to retrieve it. All right, well, this was a fun ride. I'm sure you have people behind you thinking, what is this? <laughs> Usually they're thinking, well, why don't you get out of the way? Can't you go a little bit faster? <laughs> a little faster. Jim Carter, call us again when you got some new equipment. Will do. Okay, here we are. We're going to go back to the studio as we get out of the car here.